Get ready to take a visual journey through space against the backdrop of one of the best-selling albums of all time. The Adler Planetarium has licensed legendary rock band Pink Floyd's new planetarium show, The Dark Side of the Moon. What a right? great mashup yeah. this is. The, the show was created in conjunction with the 50th anniversary of the album, released March 1st, 1973. Right now, the Adler is the only location in the U.S. that's showing it. NBC5's Leanne Trotter has a preview for us. You may have seen one of Pink Floyd's laser shows before, but this new show is different. It's not as maybe aggressive and over the top as what you might remember, but it's a very uh, fluid, a very steady show. It's beautiful to watch. In partnership with the International Planetarium Society, Pink Floyd wanted to visually showcase its newly remastered 50th anniversary edition of its most iconic album, The Dark Side of the Moon. Mark Blake wrote a Pink Floyd biography most recently Recently, he wrote a book about the people who designed all their album covers. Dark Side of the Moon blew it wide open for them, especially in the United States. It really took off for them. It was a game-changing record for them. The new planetarium show will run for a full year in the Adler's Granger Sky Theater, which has a 180-degree, 36-foot domed ceiling. A lot of people have described it as sort of 3D without the glasses. Uh, when it's when it gets dark and the lights go down and, and you're in space and you're floating and you're drifting and traveling, you, you feel like you're there. Uh, it's wonderful. Pink Floyd has a long history with planetariums around the world. In fact, when the original album was released 50 years ago they had a show at the planetarium in london they decided the sound wasn't good enough in the london planetarium so they refused to attend and so they they boycotted their own launch uh, party which is a very very pink floyd thing to do these days sound technology is much more advanced it was still just a, a, a transformative experience and frankly really kicked off the the long connection between pink floyd and planetariums tickets to see dark side of the moon are twenty dollars in addition to museum admission and must be purchased in advance reporting from the museum campus leanne trotter nbc5 news